All right, assault and battery. All right, Bill, you are right that every state is different. New York does not have battery. Assault is the physical action when you hurt someone. Menacing is when you make a person fear you will assault them. Um, Is that just in New York? Come on, guys. You know I'm dumb. I can't figure this out. Every state is different. So in New York, assault is the physical action when you hurt someone. Menacing is when... Okay, okay, so you're saying that in New York. And then other places, menacing. Well, that's a lot clearer, I think, assault and menacing, as opposed to assault and battery. Because then you think, he was beating the shit out of me. Then, you know, afterwards, he took the batteries out of his Walkman and threw them at me. Oh, Bill, really? Is that all you got? Ah, fuck you. It's a Sunday. All right, Frosties and a blowjob follow-up from a lady. Dear Billy, back in my day. Yeah, I would have thought I got more shit about the M&M store, the way Nia gave me shit. By the way, I bought M&Ms at the play. Uh, I am a lady and wanted to help the young fellas out there who want their girls or partners or whatever to go to the gym. Oh, Nia, listen to this one. This guy, he was in that awful situation where, you know, he, he... He was staying in shape, and his girlfriend, who he loved, was getting a little bigger, and he wanted to try to encourage her to go to the gym, and she kept saying that she wanted to go to the gym, but every time he would say, all right, let's go to the gym, she'd either do the little sad puppy dog thing. She did that at first, and that would work. So then when that wasn't working, she's now started to blow him. Like when Karen asked Ray Liotta for fucking money, you know? And good fellas, you want to get in on this? All right, so I was just like, how the fuck, you know, it's very hard, you know, to to communicate that. Um, Sometimes you just think the only way to say it is to say it. Hey, sweetheart, I love you, but you're getting real fat, all right? I don't want to fuck a fatty. So why don't you get to the gym and, uh, I don't know. Get on the elliptical. You, tub, you can't say that. All right. I'm a lady and one. Okay. I'm, ultimately, Bill is right. No one can make her do it. And she won't do it until she's ready. But you can try leading by example. See, this is why women are smarter than guys is because they can get people to do things without saying, I need you to do this. They can get in your head, man, and they run around. All right. You want to ease your girl into the habit of moving her body and the rest will... F- and the rest will follow. Okay, you want to get your girl into the habit of moving her body and the rest will follow. Suggest going for a walk together daily. Maybe plan your route to hit a couple of hills or a short hike with some inclines. This is fucking brilliant. Easing their way. You're like, hey, you want to go for a walk? It's a nice nice time out. And then you literally feel like, oh, here's a, here's a little more challenging hill. It's like when they would slowly turn the fucking heat up on the rat and the rat wouldn't get out of the pot. Uh, so just going for a walk daily. Okay. There's usually a time of night after dinner, mid Netflix, that you or your girl wants a sweet treat. Before that happens, go on a walk after a couple of weeks, increase that to a jog and no, not a walk to fucking Wendy's. Jesus Christ. We just said to go get something sweet. I mean, just the, she's just saying when you're getting that craving. Go for a walk. Oh, God, I'm stupid. There's usually a time of night. Before that happens, go on a walk. Oh, I see, I see, I see. All right. I mean, just the fact that she eats Wendy's Frosties, you really drink them or sort of gulp them down in frozen clumps, speaking from experience, uh, is grounds for termination in my book. What? But I digress. Come on, sit down. Who doesn't love Frosties? Come here, come here, come here. I got to get a little boo bear up. Okay. And ready for uh, the picture. Um, all right, so go on. Okay, so here we go. Nia said, what? Who doesn't like Frosties? Uh, yeah. Don't don't eat that shit. You got to dip your fries in the Frosty, too. Oh, boy, that's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, that's good, clean fun. Oh, 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 boy, oh, boy. All right. Anyways, but I digress. Don't eat that shit. Buy yourselves some real fucking ice cream. With few ingredients, if you have if you have to have it, I mean that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Or here's a fucking no brainer: when she wants a frosty, instead of her giving you a blowy, why did it become a blowy? <laughs> uh, why don't I you like just it. suggest? It cuter. It's more digestible to say blowy. It's funny. 
Instead of her giving you a blowy, why don't you suggest no frosty and you'll go down on her? There you go. Yeah, but why did... Wait a minute, Nia, I'm going to stop fucking smoking cigars and drinking booze if you blow me? I mean, where's the sacrifice on her fucking part? That is such a... You know what? You were fucking cool until there. I don't know about that one. Uh, Anyways, what a concept. Her reward for not eating like a child is an orgasm. Well... Out. Yeah. Another gross one. Dude, he fucking ate her out. Um, he performed fellatio. No. There are a group of dance. What is it? Cunnilingus. Oh, I thought fellatio was just any oral sex. No. Fellatio is sucking a dick? Correct. And what is it? Cunnilingus. Cuntilingus? Cunnilingus. Cunnilingus. C U N N. I never took a health class. I don't think they teach you about cunnilingus in health class. <laughs> they don't. They don't go, that's the vagina, and this is the guy's tongue. No. And he goes down there, and he goes, you guys know that Christmas carol? Fa la 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 <laughs> They didn't do that? No. Oh. No, my generation, we were, we were like people who learn an instrument by ear. It's all just trying to figure it out. All right. There are group dance classes in a studio or online, aerobics classes, spin classes, yoga, Pilates. All of these things have been designed to take your hard-earned money so give it to him go to yoga together go to zumba together and you'll get to well, what about his workout he wants to be all buff he wants to throw the fucking weights around oh on his off day huh? on a, like an off day where it's just like i was just gonna do 30 minutes of cardio or something like that do one i see what she's saying though the, the whole idea is like you're doing it together so it's time it's quality time together it's like fun you know it's not such a like Sure. Well, what I want to know is at some point, can he then just set her free and she can work out the way she wants to work out and he can go back to his workout where it's like, I want you to do it with me. The, the thing is, though, she like she if she doesn't want to like exercise and go to the gym, she's not going to go. And she's going to be smart enough to know that's like, wait a minute, are you trying to force me to exercise? And that could be seen as being like kind of manipulative and not cool. So, I mean... I'm all about like, you know, let's oh, let's go for a walk together. I feel like that's very like non-confrontational and non like it's just, yo, let's just go for a walk. You guys are too smart. You'll figure that out. Like, oh, now we're going to go up this hill. Oh, wouldn't it be fun to it's like, no, I thought we were just going to go on a nice walk together. Now you got me fucking huffing and puffing and all the other stuff. You didn't tell me I needed to put my fucking leggings on, you know. So Uh, this this the, the more I'm reading this email, the more it's like annoying me. Why? Cause then she goes, she goes, uh, Anyways, you'll get an ex- to experience a level of shame yourself by being a man in that environment, like these places. Uh, fucking jazzercise, bro. Time to get humble. Why does he have to do? Why does he have to like? She's acting like he didn't go to the gym. I mean, it's not like anybody's job to get their partner to where you can encourage them and be like, I want you to be healthy. I know you're worried, you know, about gaining weight or you don't want to gain weight. I just want to encourage you. I don't want to force you. But, like, let's go for, like, walks together. This is starting to sound like his girlfriend wrote this. Now it's getting a little angry because listen to this. Stop acting like going to the gym is the only way to get in shape. The gym isn't for everyone. Oh, my goodness. Why are you yelling at Is it in all caps? No, because that's the way this is reading to me. Mm-hmm. And when you're out of shape, the gym can be pretty intimidating because not everyone is comfortable with the level of shame it takes to go in there, sign up, admit you're a lazy fuck, and get on the treadmill. She's just going off the rails here. Yeah. There are so many other ways to exercise, and you got to help her find what works for her. Why is this his fucking job? Well, I mean, he wrote to you asking about it, so clearly he's thinking that it's... But I don't know, just like this fucking tone is is ridiculous. Right. Well, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what's going on over there. I don't, I don't, uh, yeah, I don't get any, any of, of that shit. Like, there's nothing, like, if, if he was... You cannot force anybody to work out and be healthy. And if he was the guy not going to the gym, like, it wouldn't be like, you need to start going to the gym and lifting weights. You know, humble yourself. This is like, this is this fucking shit. It's a one-way street. All right, sorry. All right, thank you, well, lovely Nia. We are creatures of habit. Once she gets into the habit of moving, she'll want to do it more, and then she'll dump you when she looks hot as fuck. So be uh, careful what you wish for. Uh, yeah, she went, she got all fucking, did you notice how she tried to act like she was cool, and in the end, she wasn't? <laughs> That's what I was thinking, though. I'm like, what if she really starts loving working out and gets hot and breaks up with it? Come here. So is that why you guys stay with us? So you can eat a burger? But if you if you stop eating the fucking burger, then you're gonna dump us, and, and where are you gonna go? What do you 
What does that mean? What do you mean? Because you said that you were thinking that too. Like, oh, what if she gets all hot and then breaks up with them? Like, I can do yeah. better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I mean, I just thought that would be funny. If it, it turned around and she got in amazing shape. And then she went off and, you know. Was like, I think it's funny you know that. What? I've had a clear head. I've been working out. I've been really, excuse me, meditating and taking care of myself. And I realized you're a piece of shit. Bye. Isn't it more I realize that uh, guys who are doing better than you are now looking at me and I would like to swing to the next monkey bar of a better lifestyle? Maybe. 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 Could be. Could be. <laughs> All right. I got I got it. I got to dip out. Could you be. have to dip out? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My interview skills are fucking next level. Ah, Jesus Christ. I mean, you're right there. I mean, do, do you see this this right here? This all right here is why I suggest any guy, don't be afraid if your wife ever says, hey, we, or we need to go to couples counseling. Because for the first time in their lives, somebody outside the relationship is going to tell them at some point that they're fucking wrong. Uh, but then you're going to pay for it in the car ride home. So it, it, doesn't, it doesn't work. It's just this guy loves the woman. He's trying to help her out. And in the end... She's basically telling the guy that he needs to humble himself. She, you know, all her issues with going to the gym, is, she flips out. And then in the end, she goes, hey, you know, rather than, hey, you know what? You're a really good guy. You care for your girl. You know, this is a great thing that you care so much that you're doing this. It's like, yeah, watch you get hot and fucking dump you. <laughs> all righty. All righty then. There you go. There's that.